Hey, my name is Austin Childress. I am the Director of Education for Carabello Coffee here in Newport, Kentucky, and these videos are brought to you by Roasty. Today, I'm going to do a quick overview of espresso comparisons and the different shots that you can pull, different styles, if you will. Um, so here, what we're going to start with is the one that you're most used to. So that'll be this one here in the middle. What we have is pretty much just under two ounces of espresso, um, about 40 grams in uh, or 40 grams out. And I put about 60 and a half grams into the shot of ground coffee. Um, this is what you're most used to. This will be on the kind of, so this is on the smaller end of a regular shot of espresso. Um, then we have your ristretto. So a ristretto uh, is an Italian word that means restricted. So the idea is you're restricting the amount of water that flows through the coffee grounds normally. Uh, so in this glass, I have about only an ounce of espresso. Um, this is how a lot of shop, a lot of shops will pull their espresso. Um, it's going to land somewhere between basically an ounce and an ounce and a half. Somewhere in there um, would be considered ristretto. Um, so the uses for ristretto, uh, basically it packs more of a punch because you have less volume, the same amount of coffee was used to make it. So it will be used often in lattes. If you come into our cafe, you will get a ristretto espresso uh, in any drink that you're getting because it holds up a little bit better in milk, kind of brings that espresso flavor through into your latte or cappuccino, whatever you're drinking there. And then on this end, we have a longo. Basically, this is something that is two to three ounces um, or more. Um, the idea is you're continuing to run water through coffee. So uh, essentially you're diluting it a little bit. So it can be a little bit more bitter, but it's not gonna be as punchy. Um, so these are kind of three styles of pulling espresso. Um, go ahead and ask your local shop how they're pulling theirs, uh, and you might learn a thing or two from them as well.